In today's video blog, I'm gonna go analog on you. And what I mean by analog is I wanna share this with you. These are 40 envelopes with 40 letters going out to 40 unique individuals. And the reason why I'm doing this is I belong to a local BNI chapter. If you're not familiar with BNI, you can check them out, BNI.com. It stands for Business Networking International, and it's a referral marketing group. And every year we do a visitor's day where we try and grow membership and invite people to come check out our chapter, see the type of members that we have and how they can grow their business through referral marketing. And from the referral marketing side of it, it got me thinking about, you know, in a very digital world where we're on Facebook and Twitter and we're sharing pictures and videos all the time, when's the last time you've gone analog in your marketing? For me, I have a number of different thank you cards. I have different styles, different colors. Uh, in fact, I've got five right now that I keep in my office all the time. And the reason why is that whenever I get a potential referral, if I close business, if I have a meeting with a prospect, I like to follow up with a simple thank you card. Now, the reason why I have so many different types of thank you cards is that when I'm getting to know a prospect, I may want to be a little bit more conservative depending on the conversation. However, some of my clients that I've had relationships with for the last seven years, I understand them. They understand me. We have a deeper personal relationship and it's okay to have fun like, hey, Thank you for your awesomeness. One of my favorite, by the way, it's the last one I have. However, if it's a first time client, uh, maybe they're a little bit more business minded. I'm gonna go with something a little bit more conventional, which is just a white, uh, white envelope with a thank you. Or if it's somebody who's got some personality, they like to have fun, I'm gonna use some bright colors. Here we got uh, greens and oranges and blues. And you know, you got your in-between, just straight up blue, thank you, but it's kind of a fun thought, font. And for the creative people out there, here's um, just some cool grid, thank you. So I keep these in the office, I have them in a drawer. Whenever I need to send a thank you note out, I go ahead and just grab one and send it out. The nice thing about receiving something like this in the mail is that it's really unexpected. It takes a little bit more effort, there's the handwritten note. In fact, in some of these, I actually know very well the people that are inside, and so not only did I do the generic letter, the formatted letter that we're sending out, but I also took one of my posted notes. These are little branded posted notes that I have. Don't know, it's pretty blown out. Um, branded posted notes, and I wrote a little note on there. Um, you know, whatever the little special note is that's relevant to the person I'm sending it to and actually put it on the letter and then stuffed it in the envelope. So these are some different ways that you can connect with prospects, your clients. When's the last time you said a thank you letter to your clients for being clients? It doesn't take a lot of time. And for a small business owner, that little touch can go a long way, especially today when everything, so much is automated just bringing in that personal touch can really make a difference. First of all, I would like to thank you for your awesomeness for watching this video. Secondly, I would like to challenge you to incorporate writing at least one of these thank, thank you notes on a weekly, bi-weekly, at the least, maybe on a monthly basis to prospects and clients. I'd love to know what difference that makes in your business. Leave a comment below, let me know what you think, and are there any other unique ways that you engage with your clients, either digitally or analog, that you feel creates a unique relationship with your clients so that they remember you, or a prospect so they want to do business with you. All right, everybody, take care. And I don't even know if I'm in focus.